friends and family, those are the three things that God shared with me, that there is a new resistance. And the new resistance is coming from in-house. It's coming from those who look like us, but unfortunately their hearts were not truly rooted in the will and the purpose of God. Lukewarm believers coming up against devout believers. And the Lord said that a lot of the things that we're seeing in culture right now is the birthing of sin. James chapter 1, 13 through 15, again, just paraphrasing, um, we're seeing sin come into full manifestation. Looks like the devil is, is, is producing his film, but God is saying, I'm just allowing sin to take its full course. Paul even said, I'm turning certain believers over to Satan for the destruction of the flesh. So if the preaching of the gospel won't do it because the hearts are so hard, God is going to allow our own sin to bring us, unfortunately at times, to personal destruction, to humble us, so that we may get back to God's heart, individually as Christians, but also corporately as a body. And then lastly, again, um, there are two ministries that are coming forth that we must pray for, that we must support, that we must be as mentors and some mothers and fathers of, and that is the deliverance and the prophetic movement, not criticizing it, but, but providing, hey, how can I help you? Because I see what God is doing. Even my ministry is a prophetic ministry. So instead of criticizing me, you know, you should be saying, how can I help support your ministry? Even now, we're sitting here at Revival House Network, Apostle Eric and Latrice, Fairman. Why? Because the heart is how can I support what God is doing through you, Danny, the next generation of sons and daughters.